and the light that illuminates the future. Candidates have the change to continually expand their world through the opportunities inherent in scholarship. In the wise words of Elaine Morgan, education is the one thing no one can take away from you. Service. My office is service. Service can be established in the routine of the day's work, where many opportunities arise to help others, both at school and in the community. A willingness to work for the benefit of those in need, without monetary compensation or public recognition, is a quality you seek in our membership and promote for the entire student body. We are committed to volunteering our time and talents to the creation of a better tomorrow. And talents to the creation of a better tomorrow. As Mohan Pagani once said, the best way to find yourself is to lose yourself in the service of others. Leadership. Leadership should exert a wholesome influence on the school in taking initiative in the classroom and in school activities. The real leader strives to train and aid others to reach their common goals of success. The price of leadership is sacrifice. The willingness to yield one's personal interest for the interests of others. A leader has self-confidence and will go forward when others hesitate. No matter what power and resources may exist in a school, community, or nation, they are ineffectual without the guidance of a wise leader. Leadership is always needed. Thus, to lead, a, lead is a meaningful and substantive charge to each of our members. Like Jack Welch said, before you are a leader, success is all about growing yourself. When you become a leader, success is all about growing others. And character. Character is the force within the individual that distinguishes each person from others. It creates for each of us our individuality, our goodness. It is that without which no one can respect oneself nor hope to attain the respect of others. It is this force of character that guides one through life and once developed grows steadily within. Character is achieved and not received. It is the product of constant thought and action, the daily striving to make the right choice. The problem of character is the problem of self-control. We must be in reality with what we wish to appear to others, to be rather than to see, by demonstrating such qualities as respect, responsibility, trustworthiness, fairness, caring, and citizenship. We may hope to prove by example that we value character. As, as Elmer G. Letterman once said, personality can open doors, but only character can keep them open. At this time, as your name is called, please step forward onto the stage to receive your token. The following student has. <laughs> The following student has recognized Mrs. Sara as their faculty sponsor. Mrs. Sara, please join us on the stage for the picture. Megan Flannery. Megan is an active participant in all the school activities. She's the vice president of her class and continues to make the school environment more inclusive for everybody. Megan is a very approachable person and is always looking to help out with. Thank you, Mrs. Sara, for celebrating the last 
The following students have recognized Dr. Berger as their faculty sponsor. Dr. Berger, please join us on the stage. Elena Chu. Elena is on the varsity fencing team and a member of French Honor Society. She's, a, she's passionate about the sciences and helping others. Ashley Sherman. Ashley Sherman is a dedicated student who participates in both in school and out of school activities. She is the chief editor of the Sting, junior officer for American Computer Science League, member of the Latin Honor Society, and volunteers at the Middletown Public Library. Thank you, Dr. David, for The following student has recognized Mrs. Bluestein as the faculty sponsor. Bluestein, please join us on the stage. Akshan Padmanam. Akshan is a hardworking person. He hopes to be a valuable part of many justice. Thank you, Mrs. Bluestein, for celebrating the next one. The following students have recognized Mr. Bukino as their faculty sponsor. Mr. Bukino, please join us on the stage for the next one. John King. John King is the dream of focusing on studying technology. He enjoys playing piano, listening to music, and going to bike ride. Alexander Pelgrim. Alex is a hard working student athlete who aspires to be a kinesiologist in the future. He runs track and cross country and loves to continue running and doing aesthetics in adulthood. Finley Torrance. Finley is a junior here at Humboldt High School, and although he is interested in engineering and robotics as his future career, his interests are diverse. He is a proud member of many clubs, ranging from the Homebuilt Theater Guild to Team Unified. Finley expresses his creativity in his thoughtful designs and 3D printed parts as co captain of the robotics team Hornet Blue, art contributor for the Sting, and in his free time playing Radiohead and his own compositions on the top. Thank you, Mr. Bikina. All in soon has recognized Mr. Benke as their faculty sponsor. Mr. Benke, please join us on the stage. Matthew Merkel. Matthew is a hard worker committed to giving you the He exhibits a positive outlook and always seeks you. Thank you, Mr. Becky, for celebrating with us. The following students have recognized Ms. Bosnans as their faculty sponsor. Ms. Bosnans, please join us on the stage for the opening day. Kaylee Dula. Kaylee is on the faculty staff hall team and is a part of the Spanish Honor Society. In addition, she enjoys keeping herself busy by volunteering, working, and spending time with friends and family. Casey Lapp. Casey is a hard living, respectful, kind, and driven individual. Whether it's in a classroom or on a softball field, she always gives it her all and reflects her positivity on time. Thank you, Ms. Boston, for celebrating with us. The following students have recognized Madam Cogger as their faculty sponsor. Um, Cogger, please join us on stage. Madam Cogger, please join us on stage. Kira Bechtel. Kira is a dedicated student who is part of the French Honor Society and National Art Honor Society and is vice president of the Garden Center. She volunteers at a local food pantry every Thursday, helping 130 families get their food each week. Kira thanks her family for all that they have done to help her get to this. Chloe Chong. Chloe is a dedicated student and takes pride in the activities she's involved in. She's a part of the National Art Honor Society, French Honor Society, and Girl Scouts, where she accomplished earning her silver. Chang Sinelle. Jane is a hardworking student who is part of many clubs and is an involved member of the National French Honor Society. 
She also takes her athletics very seriously, taking part in varsity swimming and track. Jenna is a thoughtful, is thoughtful and wants to improve the world around. She hopes to help society in the future by studying psychology. Thank you, Matthew Clover, for celebrating with us. The following student has recognized Mr. Dillon as their faculty sponsor. Mr. Dillon, please join us on the stage with a pencil. Stephanos Santanitas. Stephanos is a member of the Tumblr High School Pet Band, Symphonic Band, Jazz Ensemble, the Old Shore Jazz Band, the Tri and Music Honor Society, the Italian Honor Society, the Rocket Live Foundation, and the Senior Patrol Leader of Boy Scout Troop 331. And hold up. He would like to thank his family, teachers, and other mentors who have contributed to his success in his endeavor. Nicholas Rakowski. Nicholas is a dedicated scholar, passion for learning both in and out of the classroom. He demonstrates his character and leadership while serving him. The following students have recognized Mr. Carney as their faculty sponsor. Mr. Carney, please join us on stage for the winning ceremony. Aaron Edelman. Aaron is a member of the Hendrick Elmer Society, the Latin Elmer Society, and Bosley Volleyball Team. He also plans to study biomedical engineering in college. Hayden Pepper. Hayden is a hardworking student who not only shows her time on the Hunza High School varsity football and basketball cheer teams, but is also vice president of the National Honor Society for Dance Arts, as well as an active member of the Latin Honor Society and Key Club. Outside of school, Hayden enjoys dancing and working with young children as both a dance mentor and camp counselor. Matt is dedicated to schoolwork and also takes part in ice hockey and baseball. Outside of school, he is committed to the community and he is an active volunteer of his church and an Eagle Scout. Okay. Thank you, Mr. Carter, for celebrating with us tonight. The following student has recognized Ms. Davis as their faculty sponsor. Ms. Davis, please join us on the stage for the pitting ceremony. Selena Zeng. Selena is a hardworking student and cares a lot about the fun she loves. She's a member of National Art Honor Society and French Honor Society and volunteers at Bayshore Hospital. <laughs> Thank you, Ms. Davis, for celebrating with us. The following students have recognized Mr. Dowd as their faculty sponsor. Mr. Dowd, please join us on the side stage for the committee service. Tyler Lavelle. Tyler is a senior who plays varsity volleyball and becomes a volunteer in the Eagle Club. He is part of clubs at school, including Key Club, and he is an Eagle Scout who has done over 100 hours of community service. He plans on studying biology in college and continuing to study history, specifically European history. Ben Spiwa, a sincere individual who hopes to inspire those inspire those around them through their kindness and support for their well-being. Through the strong discipline, they wish to have a lasting positive impact on all. Thank you, Mr. Dr. Zalbrady. The following student has recognized Ms. Dunn as their faculty sponsor. Ms. Dunn, please join us on the stage for the pinning ceremony. Avery Lewandowski. Avery plays on the varsity football team and is a member of the Spanish Honor Society. 
She enjoys volunteering along with spending time with her family and friends. Thank you, Ms. Dunn, for celebrating with us today. The following student has recognized Mr. Bossella as their faculty sponsor. Mr. Bossella, please join us at the stage of the program. Jesse Pearson. Jesse is a music and is the greatest science by time. He thanks his study operations research. Joanna Jelly. Joanna is a conscientious student who lives by the motto, love yourself and love what you love. Thank you, Mr. Bossella, for celebrating. The following student has recognized Mr. Gurney as their faculty sponsor. Mr. Gurney, please join us on stage for the opening ceremony. Madeline Tom. Madeline is a hardworking student who is interested in international relations and passionate about social justice issues. She currently works for two nonprofits that are dedicated to aiding underprivileged communities and hopes to pursue a career in government administration or law. She'd like to thank her parents for their support and Taylor Swift for musical inspiration. <laughs> thank you, Mr. Gurney. The following student has recognized Mr. Hart as their faculty sponsor. Mr. Hart, please join us on stage for the pinning ceremony. Okay, Dedicated both on and off the field, Trey Fridgley exemplifies unwavering commitment as a hardworking student, passionate football player, and a devoted community helper. Trey embodies resilience, teamwork, and a compassionate spirit, leaving an indefinable mark not only in the classroom and on the field, but also within the heart of the community he supports. The following student has recognized Mr. Herman as their faculty sponsor. Mr. Harmon, please join us on the stage for the same ceremony. Jake Harris, a hardworking student who is dedicated to service and benefiting the community only house all the school, his most notable commitments are Castle Jews Animal Rescue, Really for Life, and Sister Pat's Kids Camp for Chronically Ill Children. Thank you, Mr. Herman, for celebrating. The following students have recognized Mr. Fell as their faculty sponsor. Mr. Fell, please join us on the stage for the coming journey. Paige Baker. Paige is a varsity cheerleader who went to fall and went to season at the end of the Mock Outside of school, she is a member of the St. Catherine's Youth Group as a board member and is the coach for youth cheerleaders. Juliana Penny. Juliana is a dedicated student who actively participates in fall, winter, and competition cheer in addition to coaching a youth cheer team. Juliana is also the president of Team Unify at the high school, and she spends time outside of school volunteering at the local church. Thank you, Ms. Rathel, for celebrating with us today. The following students have recognized Dr. Dakota as their faculty sponsor. Dr. Kokoda, please join us on the stage for the penny ceremony. Lucian Cacciatore. Lucian is a hard lesson, creative, and passionate player. He's always there when his friends meet him, but he still makes time for the community and school. Zachary Price. Zachary Price is the leader of Hongo High School. He is the president of the Young Investors Society Club and is an active member of Team Unify and plays on the high school varsity hockey team. We would like to thank his family for all of their support. Thank you, Dr. Kokoda, for celebrating with us tonight. The following students have recognized Ms. Kerner as our faculty sponsor. Ms. Kerner, please join us on the stage for the pinning ceremony. Matthew Campbell. Matthew is a dedicated scholar in the of the college and is committed to learning. He demonstrates the pillars of NHS through his efforts within Holmesdale High School and beyond. Yeah. 
Tyler Reddy. Tyler is an active member of the school community. He has been the student council treasurer since freshman year. He is a part of the Future Business Leaders of America Club, Italian Honor Society, a member of Team Unified Sports, and on the varsity basket baseball team since his freshman year. He would like to thank all of his teachers, coaches, family, and especially his parents for all of their ongoing support. The following students have recognized Senora Nice as their faculty sponsor. Senora Nice, please join us on the stage for the pinning ceremony. Sabini Amara Di Wakara. Sabini is part of the Robotics Club and Spanish Honor Society. She thanks her family and teachers for allowing her the opportunity to reach this point in her high school career. Victoria Finnamore. Victoria is a hardworking student who has shown a solid commitment to academic excellence as well as her character outside of school. She has established herself as an exceptional student due to her persistent for knowledge and her ability to do well in challenging academic settings. Kathleen Petretti. Kathleen is a dedicated student who participates in Key Club, Light the Candle, and the Career Explorers Club. She enjoys spending her time volunteering at the John Bon Jovi Soul Kitchen, her church's youth group, and the Castle of Beauty's Animal Rescue. Tatum Lynch. Tatum is a high school student who participates in both ball and just here as well as cross. She is an active member in Career Leaders and Light the Candle Club and enjoys volunteering at the Castle of Beauty's outside of school. Thank you, Senora Nice, for celebrating with us tonight. The following student was recognized this Magno as a faculty sponsor. This Magno will be showing us on the stage for the finish ceremony. Martin Duviano. Martin Duviano is a tenacious nice for people and accomplished by one more than that. When she was in not only in martial arts, but also in concert. She excels in challenging courses of AP Kappa. As a dedicated Taekwondo instructor, she imparts leadership and commitment and body the principles of the National Art Society. Thank you, Ms. Magna, for celebrating with us tonight. The following student has recognized Ms. Olivia as a faculty sponsor. Ms. Olivia, please join us on stage for the penny center. Sapata is a dedicated student who puts her best work in everything she does. She is an artistic and creative person who is involved in many extracurriculars. Thank you, Ms. Louisiana, for celebrating with us tonight. The following students have recognized Mrs. McCarthy as a faculty sponsor. Mrs. McCarthy, please join us on the stage with the baby song. Sean McCarthy. Sean McCarthy is a member of the English community. He gives his best ways to find the back to the community that has given him so much. Stephen Hunt. Stephen is a student of Virgo and wants to sit close to us. He's a child of a passion and towards others and is always wanting to learn new things. <laughs> Thank you, Mrs. McCarthy, for celebrating the rest of all. The college of student has recognized Ms. Warren Kudish as our faculty sponsor. Ms. Warren Kudish, please join us on the stage for the beginning ceremony. Anna Zunis. Anna is a girl who puts herself out there and works hard to work with her hands. She is one of the four parties who are the most important for all the public, the most important public speaker, and somebody who enjoys the most. The following students have recognized Miss Moore as a faculty sponsor. Miss Moore, please show us a few things. Natalie Klein. Madeline is a member of the Mother's Closet Institute, who is constantly involved in the community. 
She's a part of the Girls Varsity Center, a girl team, and an active member of Spanish Honor Society, peer leaders, and women. Mara Shriyanka. Mara Shriyanka is a part of the Girls Varsity Center, a peer leadership, and helping our community. She's excited to share her ideas and need to create a partnership that connects on those around her. Thank you, Ms. Moore, for celebrating with us tonight. Olivia Kim. Olivia Kim is a member of the Girl Attack and an icon of the Hall of Fame of the Jewish Women and the Jewish Players. She thanks her parents, teachers, and peers around her for helping her grow into the person she is. Mark Rutosa. Mark Rutosa is a member of the Jewish Development of the Government and the Family Homes and respected others. Mark never withholds his proficiency in all aspects and always ensures the delivery of the very best. We would also like to thank the Mrs. Michonne, Coach Reagan, Cincinnati, Cannon, and all the other coaches for providing him with the moral compass and the principles that will guide him through his life. Kathy is an accomplished student who has felt that the energy and has an opportunity to explain the system. She hopes to use her natural curiosity and mobile science to aid and extend care to those in the future, both in school and in her career path ahead. Nicholas Clifford, a dedicated scholar who has been an academic advocate in the leading places, and like the president of the school. Dax Cornero. Dax is a very athletic and gender driven, equally close to Dr. Lenny and sacrifices his wants for others' needs. He cherishes all the support from those around him, ranging from his loving family to his basketball coaches and teachers, and would not be put in the position he's in for the person he is today without them. Mahika Jawa. Mahika is a perfect medal and also a perfect medal, and is a great the Soul of Community for Scholarship, Mahika co founded the organization STEM Power Kids to spread our excitement for STEM to students and to preserve our community. Ashley Wong. Ashley Wong is a person of not going to be a not going to be a good person. She's worth working and considering. Lillian Stafford. Lillian is not talking about your work. The father of the student who wants to say something that sounds like that. Emma Tesla. Tony Plutzker is a hard working student who is active in many organizations, both in and outside the school. She is the president of Athletes Get Back, vice president of the future positions of the a member of the French Honor Society, a part of the Homeville Varsity Dance Team and a volunteer at Friendship Circle. Riley Baller. Riley is a student, student who is passionate about biology and wants to pursue a career in the medical field. She loves to work with others and feels that helping people who are sick will be a great and fulfilling way to help them. Mm -hmm. This thing is responsible, kind, and caring. She is a unique and funny person and dreams of improving lives through the pursuit of science. The following student has recognized Mrs. Montana as their faculty sponsor. <laughs> High school last year, and since then has shown us what a talented individual she is. Currently, she is part of the National Art Honor Society as well as a co president for the mock trial team here in Hong Kong. Thank you, Mrs. Montana, for celebrating with us. The following student has recognized Ms. Murphy as a faculty sponsor. Ms. Murphy, please join us on stage for the thing. 
caring and dedicated to her work in and out of school. She aspires to work in the medical field where she continues to help the people around her. Thank you, Mrs. Murphy, for celebrating her birthday. The following student is recognized Mr. Petricola at the back of the sculpture. Mr. Petricola, please join us on the stage with a thing, sir. Celeste Kwok. Celeste Kwok is a dedicated student both inside and outside school. She not only keeps up with her studies, but she is part of FHS, the cross country and track team, and does four hours of volunteering every week for a disability center, making sure to spend her time in a meaningful way year round. Thank you, Mr. Pesciola, for celebrating. The following student has recognized Mr. Quinn as their faculty sponsor. Mr. Quinn, please join us on the stage for the concert. Jack is a two sport varsity athlete, making an impact on both the girls and football teams. As president of the student council, he also works hard to serve his peers. Brian Holby. Brian Holby is a hardworking, caring student who excels both in and out of the classroom. When faced with adversity, his resilience allows him to overcome challenges and work to achieve his goal. Thank you, Mr. Quinn, for celebrating with us tonight. Ethan Manovich. Ethan, known for his determination and passion for collaboration, has navigated a successful path so far through his own resilience and teamwork. Ethan's work ethic has led to his remarkable achievements, proving that personal integrity and meaningful engagement are two very important qualities to have. Joseph Satilli. Joseph is the son of Michelle and Marcelin and the brother of Gianna Stone. He enjoys playing both club and high school ice hockey, runs an X XC and track, enjoys being a member of the TV and Folk Society, is the sports anchor for the Hornet Report, and is an active parishioner at St. Catherine's. Okay. Following students have recognized Coach Jeff Reynas as their faculty sponsor. Coach Jeff Reynas, please join us on the stage for the Hornet State. Dante Calcaterra Dante is a senior at Holmdel High School and has a three-year start on varsity football and track. He would like to thank his family and friends for their support and encouragement. Dimitri Lazura. Dimitri is a diligent young man who is a varsity athlete on the field. He approaches every opportunity with commitment and enthusiasm. Thank you, Coach Jeff Rains, for celebrating with us today. Julia Sapalis. Julia is a diligent student whose hard work sends beyond the classroom. Serving her community with distinction, she not only excels academically but also contributes significantly as a board member of the Teacher Positions of America Club and is a proud participant in the French Honor Society. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The following student has recognized Ms. Roberts as their faculty sponsor. Ms. Roberts, please join us on the stage for the cleaning ceremony. Mm -hmm. Dana Allen. Dana is a Palestinian American student who plays an active role in advocating for her. 
community. Dana is a part of the music honor society, Italian honor society, and lesbians honor society. Dana is passionate about literature and music and hopes to one day work in choral direction and vocal pedagogy. She would like to thank her family for all their Thank you, Bobby, for celebrating with us tonight. Following student has recognized Ms. Samantha as their faculty sponsor. Claudia Diaz grabs on my communication across various facets of school. Raising participation in varsity lacrosse this year, Black Trials, Young Investor Society. Key Club, Career Explorers Club, Spanish Honor Society, and Unified Cheer. Claudia extends heartfelt gratitude to her family, teachers, and coaches for fostering a wonderful and fulfilling high school experience. Thank you, Ms. Manchek, for celebrating the next The following students have recognized Mrs. Chang Perry as the top of the Mrs. Chang Perry, please join us on the stage for the main ceremony. Me and Marisa. Me and Junior Bound athlete, participating in cheer in the fall and winter as a cross in the spring. Outside of school, she is a member of the St. Catherine's Youth Group and a coach for youth cheerleaders in Holda. Alexia Zambito. A few things to know is dedicated to student athletes and athletes. Committed to giving 1% to her school, community, and extracurriculars. Alexia is a member of various clubs. The school's field hockey team, and in advancing her goals to pursue international relations, Alexia currently serves as the president of Mala Yuen, as well as the chief editor of SPIN. She would like to thank her parents and Ms. Trang for everything. Thank you, Mrs. Trang Perry, for celebrating with us tonight. Thank you, Mrs. The following student has recognized Senora Taylor as your faculty sponsor. Senora Taylor, please join us on the stage for the main ceremony. Trey is a talented and fun person that is very involved in many of the activities here in Hongo High School. She dreams of helping people in the community and all around the world. Thank you, Senora Taylor, for celebrating with us today. The following student has recognized Mr. Tuma as a top of the Mr. Tuma, please join us on the stage with the team's <laughs> I think we're going to is a member of the Spanish Arm Society and is involved in clubs such as like the Candle, Peer Leadership, and Youth Alliance, which allow her to get involved in both school and community. She is also part of the Humble High School cheer team and a competition yesterday. <laughs> Marco is an active member of the Home Computer Guild, Italian Honor Society, and the TV and Film Society. He also studied writing in college. He would like to thank his entire family for their constant support. Uh -huh, my dear. Among the is a junior, the president of the chess club and the team's first board. He likes the program, participating in the ACSL, spends time outside of school volunteering at a nonprofit organization called Asbury Park African American Music Project, and is a Taekwondo black belt. He plans to study computational sociology in the future. Gabrielle Ning. Gabriel Romani is a member of the varsity dance team, Spanish Arm Society, and frequently volunteers at various community events. She would like to thank her parents for all their love and encouragement. James Snow. James Snow enjoys studying history and mathematics. In his free time, he is building connections with a group of diverse and loyal friends in search of the legendary treasure. Thank you, Mr. Suma, for celebrating with us today. The following student has recognized Ms. Venturelli as her faculty sponsor. Ms. Venturelli, please come 
and join us on stage for the Pink Panther. We can see Kevin. Mackenzie Keevan is a diligent student who is the president of the American Sign Language Club, part of the Girls Varsity Basketball Team, and the Honor Society. She loves participating in the in community service and can't wait to be involved in the National Honor Society. Thank you, Ms. Venturelli, for celebrating that. <laughs> the following student has recognized Ms. Suchek as their faculty sponsor. Ms. Suchek, please join the Danielle Holman. Danielle Holman is a high achieving student with dreams of becoming a doctor, and her commitment to excellence extends beyond academics to impact the community service, notably with the humble first aid. Her dedication to scholarship, leadership, and service makes Daniela a wonderful addition to our distinguished group. Thank you, Mr. Chuck, for the Cooper Bills. Cooper Bisland embodies the nature of pillars of scholarship, character, leadership, and service with an added fervor of the, for the performing arts. When he is not studying or in rehearsals, he enjoys spending time with his Friday crew or channeling his creativity. Smiling projects for his good, pretty friends. Sophie is a member of the Latin Honor Society and the field producer of the Horner Report. Who plans to pursue executive producing and directing at her college? She would like to thank her parents for helping her achieve her goals in and out of school. Ronald Fitz, Ronald is a passionate, hard working social science scholar and language learner. They put much effort into teaching the school spirit a lot. Braden is a hard working and dedicated student who has many people to thank for that, including teachers and family. Brandon could not have made it here without their guidance and support. I'm ready to a respectful young man who has a great work ethic and is dedicated to his advancement and education at Holmes High School. He is also soon after he studies and trains to be the best he can be in both school and in school. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. in many school activities, including President mm -hmm. Speak Club and a member of the Spanish Art Society. Outside of school, she is the tutor for the Board of Gordons and takes part in NYU's High School Law Institute. Now we will dim the lights for our candle ceremony. Thank you. 
Will the viewing of these please raise your right hand and repeat the pledge? The audience can follow the text of currently in the program. Please join me in reciting the pledge. I pledge to uphold the high purposes of the National Honor Society, the high purposes of the National Honor Society, to which I have been selected. To which I have been selected, I will be true to the principles for which it stands. I will be true to the principles for which it stands, and will maintain and encourage, and will maintain and encourage the high standards, the high standards of scholarship, leadership, service, and character. Of scholarship, leadership, service, and character. Thank you. You may be. And now the HHS Jazz Combo, including some of our newly inducted members, of our new members. <laughs> Yeah. That was amazing. Thank you. You may cut these, you may be seated. Tomorrow is my birthday. So we have to change. I'm just going to 
Oh. And now, please welcome our principal, Dr. Jacoba, who will offer congratulatory remarks to the new principal. Good evening, everyone. On behalf of our superintendent of schools, Dr. Scott Cascon, it is my pleasure to close the National Honor Society induction ceremony this evening. As you know, National Honor Society recognizes academic achievement, fosters and recognizes leadership skills and character development, encourages growth ethically and socially, and encourages member involvement in service learning initiatives. Sounds like a good definition. What does that even mean? We know at a minimum, it means to maintain an exemplary grade point average that is required for admission. And while we as a society always place a strong emphasis on academic performance, we also know that the world is filled with many smart people who don't always demonstrate morals and ethics that are the very core of what it means to be a member of an honor society. As National Honor Society members, you're the leaders of your class and you represent the very best of our school. You embody all the wonderful characteristics associated with being a home bell hornet. Because you are hitting the mark in each of these areas, you are sit sitting before us tonight receiving this honor. Perhaps the greatest component of the National Honor Society is that it's not just about the honor roll. To be part of this prestigious organization, you have to earn, you have to do so much more than earn good grades. Membership includes a record of public service. This involves volunteering for activities that do not benefit the student financially or materially. The key to service is that it happens selflessly. There is no direct benefit to the students for volunteering for service. However, I hope these students have felt and learned the indirect benefits of the difference they make when they choose to serve others. I think that the lessons learned in service may serve these students longer than much of the academics learned in the classroom. According to the National Honor Society, student leaders are often viewed as those students who are resourceful, good problem solvers, involved in and promoters of school activities, idea contributors, dependable, and who are both organized and organizers. Having sponsored and coached a wide variety of extracurricular activities, I have seen firsthand uh, student leadership, and I'm always impressed with those students who are able to take initiative to accomplish complicated tasks. Leadership and service go hand in hand because often the leader has to set the example by being the hardest worker. Sometimes leading others is the greatest service a person can achieve. Finally, character. To me, a positive character is the foundation upon which service, leadership, and academic excellence can express themselves. Without good character, none of the other three matter much. Perhaps the greatest indication of character is honesty. I believe that as human beings, we are all fallible. Wisdom is not something we are born with. It is something acquired from learning from our mistakes one at a time. Considering all of that, how wonderful it is to stand before these fine young people who have earned these, learned, uh, learned these lessons so much sooner than I. Members of the National Honor Society, I am truly humbled by the example, and I have every confidence that all the skills that you've earned in your membership in the organization will serve you well in the bright future awaiting each one of you. Thank you again for inviting me. We are very proud of you. Congratulations. I'd like to thank our advisor, Ms. Fox, and the members of the induction ceremony committee for their hard work in organizing this year's induction ceremony. Please join me in thanking Aditi Val, Andre Pati Lisson, Ashley Perigine, Elizabeth Perigine, Ava Down, Graydon Savage, Ella Blackmore, Gabriella Postigo, 
Grace Koenig, Hayden Selam, Julia Saperito, Sophia Campbell, and Tiana Minions with a round of applause. Thank you all for attending our NHS induction ceremony. In just a moment, the new inductees will recess, after which you are all invited to join us in the comments for our reception in their honor. But before doing so, please join me once again in applauding all of our new Honor Society inductees. Thank you. And now, will everyone please stand as our newest members of the National Honor Society. That means you may be sent to the college. Thank you. 